Now more on a story KTexas first brought you last night at 10 o'clock. Paroled murderer Wayne East is back in jail. East was arrested by Glen Heights police for a parole violation, and he's now in the Dallas County Jail, also charged with indecency with a child. KTexas reporter Michelle Frizzalone spoke with the district attorney and local law enforcement about the many twists this case has taken. Michelle? Braid, that's right. Wayne East served a life sentence in a Texas prison for murdering an Abilene woman. He was paroled late last year, and local law enforcement, along with the district attorney, worked really hard to try to make sure East didn't come back to Abilene and Taylor County. Wayne East was convicted of the 1981 murder of Abilene artist Mary Eula Sears. After spending 30 years in prison, he was granted parole late last year. Law enforcement believed then and has believed all along that, uh, that, that Wayne East was a dangerous person. Local law enforcement, along with D.A. Edson, asked the Texas Department of Criminal Justice to not release East back into Abilene or Taylor County. It, it was an issue of protection of, of this community, but, but also it, it wasn't in Wayne East's best interest to come back to Abilene either. There were several of us uh, here in this community in law enforcement and the judicial system that, that uh, really got on that bad wagon, if you would say, and letters were sent to the Pardon Parole Board, and I'm glad that they did take a close look at that. It turns out their fears of East may have been confirmed. He was arrested for a parole violation and days later charged with indecency with a child. Police Chief Stan Stanridge says, I have no knowledge of this new offense, but if true, I am saddened that another victim has been traumatized. Uh, it's upsetting also too to, uh, to society to see something like this occur. And East is in the North, uh, excuse me, the North Tower Jail in Dallas on a $100,000 bond.